so the next question in this c++ series is vector sort so this is the introductory part of vector so like this is the integer type of vector like this is the declaration this is the size with this size function we can find the size of our vector and these are the methods pushback and popback and this is the method that we are going to use in this function sort method in this sort method we have to pass two means we have to call like v dot begin and v dot end means starting of the vector and ending of the vector so now here they are giving the total number of elements in and these are the elements so here what they okay so we have to write the code form from starting so first of all we will take the input so we want to take this five number of elements so i will declare one variable yun and i will take that using c in c in left side ko hota hai kya uh, yeah i think it is in the left so now we have to take these take all these elements 1 6 means these elements and we want to save these elements into vector so for that we i am going to first of all declare the vector so i will directly copy this control c and here i will paste it control v so we have declared our vector integer vector because we are taking the integer elements now we want to take that all elements so for that i will iterate a loop for int i is equal to 0 i is less than n because we want to take five elements like which n is coming that and i plus plus now we have to take input using c in c in and we'll take one variable and save that okay so here we will take another variable extra variable element like that so here c in and elt okay so we will take the, our element in this element variable and we will push push this element into vector so for that which method we have to apply pushback method so v dot pushback so like that so here we will write v dot push back and in this pushback we are passing the element that is coming in our input so just like we are taking all these elements and we are saving all this element into our vector now our vector has these five elements now we have to apply this sort function so i will just copy this sort method same method that we have to apply here and control v now lastly i think we have to print the vector means here we have to show the output that's why we are going to print the vector so for that we have to write for loop again for loop int i is equal to 0 i is less than n i plus plus and here we directly see out and v of i directly we can access the vector using this type otherwise we can use that v dot begin v dot end also no problem so we'll run the code there are three four type two three types that we can iterate the vector and so why it was giving error so here i think we have to give the space that's why it was giving error so we will run now that was a simple problem so this was about the introductory part of vector and that's it so so thank you